During the COVID-19 pandemic, some businesses closed their doors for good, but there are business owners who planned, built, and opened their business during it all. Eyewitness News reporter Cody Butler joins us live outside Spark Coffee in Stroudsburg. Cody. Mark, good evening. This coffee shop across the street has been open for one week now. The co-owner worked as a uh, meat packer and decided she wanted to open a cafe. Jill Milia spent three decades in the food industry. At the end of last year, it came time to hang her hat up and put on a much different kind of apron. It's time to do a little pivot and open a coffee shop. And that's where we came up with Spark Coffee. It has taken Melia and her partner more than six months to find the North 7th Street location, buy equipment, and brew the right coffee. It all happened during the COVID-19 pandemic. We looked at each other and said, let's just push forward. And we gave us more time to hone our craft. So encouraging. I honestly, I thought that most businesses were going to go out of business through this and to see that, you know, there's still families that are making their dreams come true and starting a new beginning. In hopes they would be open, Kathleen Moore and her mother stopped in for the first time to taste what the new business has to offer. I like iced coffee, so hazelnut's my go-to and that's what I got today, so we'll see how it is. Now this shop has more than just coffee. It has cappuccino, smoothies, pastries, and more. Mark, I do not drink coffee, but my photographer bought some coffee. How was it? What do you rate it? He gives it a two thumbs up. In Stroudsburg, Cody Butler, Eyewitness News. Mark. The, co the coffee would be cold by the time it comes back here. Otherwise, I'd say bring back a two thumbs cup for me. Thanks, Cody.